And looking beyond the school year, many parents are still wondering out there what their child care options are going to really look like come this summertime. Doing the side's Kelly Dudzik has some pretty important information for families tonight. Today I checked in with a bunch of child care providers to see what the plans are for this summer. And just like all of us, they're having to switch things up. The town of Amherst Youth and Rec Department posted a notice on its website saying that due to the state of emergency in Amherst, summer camp registration is postponed. It says updates will be posted on social media. The Niagara Falls Boys and Girls Club is providing free child care right now seven days a week for children whose parents are essential employees. These changes mean that instead of the focus being on after school programs, the Boys and Girls Club is now providing three meals a day and two snacks a day and has expanded its hours. For the summer, as it stands right now, child care there is mostly going to be for essential workers. We are hoping as things kind of progress and change that we're able to add um, more specialized programs and to be able to serve more kids. But the reality is you're not going to go from where we are today to right back to normal, kids running around, jam-packed buildings. Um, by the time summer hits, that we have to maintain the health and safety of the kids, uh, be able to still adhere to social distancing protocols, the sanit sanitation, uh, where you have lower staff to use ratios that we'll be implementing. So, I mean, the biggest thing is just like we all are now, watching daily, trying to figure out what's going on with schools, it's the same thing with summer. New tonight at 6, I'll have more options for child care this summer for parents and families. In Buffalo, Kelly Dudzik, Channel 2 News. Thank you, Kelly. Well, summer camps and recreational programs are the focus of tonight's interactive poll. And we asked you, if summer camps are allowed to open, will your child attend one this summer? Well, your choices are yes, no, and undecided. And so far, you can see no is currently in the lead. You can keep your votes coming at WGRZ.com slash vote or by logging onto our mobile app.